everyone i'm going to share with you how to make a not a beautiful basket if you don't have fabric like this i got it from walmart last time i went to walmart and i walked around by accident and saw this on sale for a dollar fifty isn't that adorable fabric it's already cut for you i love it so i got a whole bunch and now i'm decide to share with you what to do the fail fabric right here this is five inch by 15 inches if you want to enlarge the side as long as you have this long side divide by three evenly so when i cut it like this and i divide by three so i have five by five and then i have three blocks okay and if you cut seven inches wide then this needs to be 21. See, you can cut it smaller if you like, everyone. Or you can leave it. I'll show you later. And um, from here, you go into place. The first one is about an inch at the corner right here. Place this one on like that. And then the second one right side together. So the third one is right here. After that, you're gonna fold it to the front and then press in this. That's so light. Press this out and then on the side right here, you go and trim this out. I want if you like too. Like this, and then you pin this. before you sew and continue to do the same exact thing until you go all the way to the other the other end so you sew on this line exactly like this after that you move this out and then you cut an extra you cut it right here and then you add you can cut it right here and then you're going to add more and more and more and more and sew exactly the same Now on this right side, I like you to on each line right here. You don't have to, but it made nicer. If you go to close to each fold here and top stitch right on that, go right in here, right here, and then here, right on that so line right there. And you're doing that until you sew all this line right down here, okay, all the way. So everyone, I have made two, exactly the same, and then after that, I top stitch on the, the fold right here, the sew line. 
and this is how it is so right after you put it together you can go around and cut whatever extra hanging around and i also cut the lining for this this lining so now it's still five inches by 15. so i have one inch on each end extra and then one inch on each side so then i'm blazing this over and make sure yep. on the side on the four corners bring into the pointy iron this down bring into the pointy iron this down and this one same thing the pointy of the blue touching the pointy of the other one So the first fold, you're going to touch in this one, like this, okay? Now you're going to fold it again like this fold it in one more time so after you've done the top and the bottom and the side that you need to do this two one right here when you do that you're gonna fold in this way I want this area to be thicker and then fold in this way a triangle you don't need to iron if you don't want to it work out fine with or without iron okay and then some here you're gonna fold with the first one it touching the side like this and then your final fold fold it in like this and then this side right here it meet up the side right here very evenly You put in together you can see it meet up right here it's nice and at the corner you go on we're going to sew it down so the two here so over here and so over here do the same thing to the other piece everyone
Now you're finished with one. You're gonna make another one like this with the the line and, and so it's act the same everyone. Everyone we have two right here. It's already sewed thin and um, so now we're gonna go in the back and we're gonna measure the side. So this is 15. Then you gotta do five, five, and five. So mark five, five, and the other way. We just wanna make sure it's doing really, really good so everything will be even. Five, and then five here. You bring this two over and do exact the same. Five, five, and if you do bigger, you know what to do. As long as you divide this into five, um, three, five, and five. Okay, so now we're going to place together, and then we'll start sewing this in. So five and five. Gonna make sure it's staying like that. So you follow this line and you go on to sew to here and then follow this line you go on to sew to here. So you saw on this two line, this one right here, you're going to do the same thing. Because it's dark right there, you can see, you may have to draw. Nice and even. That's the main thing. So now go ahead and sew this in. Sew this in. Now after I sewed it in, I sew this together and then this together too. Okay, so I start from here. To down and to here and here to here and then from here down to here so it's like a square now you're gonna put in together like this all four sides we go on to your ladder stitch go inside go into this side do a few times or you can do any stitch you like everyone you want to go all the way like that at the same time you can do that or you can go a ladder stitch okay and now I'm going to go in this way so you can see on this side and I'm going to the inside where the fold here the, the side of the fold pull Go to the side and the other. Pull. Continue doing the whole thing the same stitch. So it's going to this side. And then go to this side. And when you're done, you don't see the sole line. You can call it invisible. And then go into this side. You can go from the, the bottom up, this bottom up, or you can go from the side down. Whatever make it easier for you. Okay, so continue doing the same stitch like this. You can start from the bottom up. Okay, from here you're going to do exact the same. There's only four sides. 
do that same and then this too so then after that you have a very cute basket hey everyone i finished and so when you use the uh, ladder stick or invisible stick you don't see anything on the side here. you see this and this is it i am finished look at that everyone good side you can put the candy in here or you can put anything for your soul and anything you like stay safe and take care everyone thank you so much for watching please don't forget to turn the bell notification on so you don't miss any of my new video and also click on the like button if you like our video and watch the video to the end if you can